वेलकम बैक इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व प्रॉब्लम वन डैश एटी टू दैट इज टेकन फ्राम चैप्टर नंबर वन स्ट्रेस एंड बुक नेम इज मैकेनिक्स ऑफ मटीरियल बाई आर सी हेबलर सो स्टेटमेंट इज द स्टील पाइप इज सपोर्टेड ऑन सर्कुलर बेस प्लेट एंड कंक्रीट पेडिस्टल इफ द थिकनेस ऑफ पाइप इज फाइव मिलीमीटर एंड द बेस प्लेट हैज़ अ रेडियस ऑफ वन फिफ्टी मिलीमीटर डिटरमाइन द फैक्टर ऑफ सेफ्टी अगेंस्ट फेलियर ऑन स्टील एंड कंक्रीट The applied force is 500 kilo newton, and normal failure stresses for steel and concretes are 350 megapascal, and for concrete is 25 megapascal respectively. So you can see this figure. This is the pipe having outer radius is 100 millimeter, and thickness is given as 5 millimeter. It is acted upon by axial load of 500 kilo newton, and this is mounted on a base plate. You can see this base plate of radius R. The base plate is mounted on concrete pedestal. So you have to find the uh, uh, factor of safety for this steel pipe and for this concrete. The failure stresses for steel is this, and for concrete is 25 megapascal. So let's start with the solution. So first, I will find the for for steel. I will find the uh, normal stress in steel pipe. So we know that average normal stress in steel pipe is equal to load per unit area of steel. So load is given as 500 kilo newton. So I will write 500 into 10 raised to power 3. And what about the area of this steel pipe? So this is circular pipe, and this will be the area. You can see this shaded portion will be the area. So we have our outer is 100 millimeter, and thickness is not known. So we know that uh, uh, our outer is equal to our inner plus T. That this is our inner. Clear? So our inner will be equal to our outer minus T. Our outer is zero point one meter in meter. It is zero point one, and thickness is zero point zero zero five meter. You can see over here. So you will get our inner will be equal to zero point zero 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 point zero nine five meter. Now area of this steel pipe will be equal to pi into our outer square minus our inner square. So put the value pi. Into our outer is zero point one square minus zero point zero nine five square. So you will get area of this steel pipe will be equal to zero point nine seven five into ten raised to power minus three times pi, and the unit will be square meter. So you can put the value over here zero point nine seven five. Into ten raised to power minus three times pi, and you will get the average normal stress in this steel pipe, which comes out to be one sixty three point two four mega pascal. Now, what we will do is that we will find the average uh, normal stress in concrete. So I will write it for concrete. For concrete. The average normal stress in concrete is equal to axial load divided by area of concrete. So P is five hundred kilo newton. So five hundred into ten to the power three. And what about area of concrete? So area of concrete will be the same as area of base plate because this is mounted on concrete pedestrian, and its radius is R. So its area will be equal to pi into R square. So average normal stress in concrete will be equal to 500 into 10 raised to power 3 divided by pi, and a uh, radius of this base plate is 0.15, which is the same as radius of concrete, so 0.150 square. So when you solve this, you will get the average normal stress in concrete comes out to be 7.074 mega. Pascal. So I will write average normal stress in concrete is seven point zero seven four mega pascal. Since we have been asked to find the factor of safety for steel pipe, so I will write. We know that factor of safety is equal to 
failure stress factor of safety for steel i will first calculate for steel so it is failure stress for steel divided by normal stress in this steel so put the value failure stress is given as 25 megapascal so 25 uh, megapascal clear for steel 25 okay this is for concrete for steel it is 350 megapascal so i will write it as 350 megapascal divided by the normal stress in steel which is 163.24 so you will get factor of safety for steel will be equal to 2.14 and for factor of safety for concrete will be equal to failure stress in concrete divided by average normal stress in concrete so failure stress in concrete is 25 megapascal so 25 divided by average normal stress in concrete is 7.074 .07 megapascal so you will get factor of safety for concrete is 3.53 so these are the answers of our this is factor of safety for steel and this is factor of safety for concrete which means that steel is 2.14 times safer for the given load and concrete is 3.53 times safer than the uh, given for the given load and that was all about this problem 1-82 i hope you have enjoyed this video and you have learned from it those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest videos also share my videos in your commit community and help me in growing my channel further if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching